tomorrow today. That's the name of the pavilion. Great, great name for a pavilion. Yeah, it's called that because this year's focus is the Epcot Overhaul. Epcot Overhaul. Epcot Overhaul. There's a few other projects yeah, done in the pavilion. Yeah, the, uh, focus is the, ho the hotel. The hotel, uh, the Hong Kong Castle. I thought we'll take it. Oh. We started here and there. Okay, well, let's start at Adventures Campus because that's the closest thing that's the to most us. That's the relevant thing to us. Yeah. I mean, to me, Epcot's more important, but this is the most relevant. Right, right. Uh, Avengers Campus. Now, now no, this is also going to mention Marvel stuff and a couple of the other parts as well. Oh, will it? Okay. And you've been in here already, right? Yeah, I, I took a little, uh, kind of sweet on What am I looking at? What is this? You're looking at a board just to kind of give you an idea of... Oh, okay. Some of the concept art. Yeah. This one's kind of giving you a sort of, like, a aesthetic, right? Spider-Bot. Now, apparently... There's one the, behind you, too. The spider right there. Suggested that you, it might be like a build a droid or something like that. If it is something, definitely not something to that scale or quality. That's big. Yeah. yeah. That, again, that's, that's a, Well, and I don't, you know what, you're right, because that doesn't even look like, I don't see any no. attachable parts. Again, that's something that goes in the ride, that's not a merch yeah. thing. So that's a spider bot, which will probably feature in the ride, then I'm guessing. Yeah. Oh, by the way, here's a model for Quinjet, which by the way is parts not on the building you thought it would be. I, well, did you see my video on that? I, I haven't had a chance yet. Yeah. But also, the building you thought it was was not the building nope. you thought it was. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Doctor Strange thinks in a quarter you can't really get a good angle. Well, there's and there's no sanctum centorum as far as oh, I can it's, tell. It's like a it's more like a courtyard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, but yeah, here's the Quinjet. There is a Quinjet, yeah, just not where we thought yeah. it was. And the idea is that there was a sanctum in that spot. Uh, there used to be a sanctum. There. And the really? and Strange has just now revealed the ruins. It happens to be right where Stark decided to build a campus. Really. Yeah. There's a whole little poster over there we'll get to that talks about Okay. It. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about that. So this is the sort of stylized model of our okay. Wait, is this Paris or Paris? Oops, sorry. Uh, this, is, sorry this is the Paris. This is Paris what? Uh, Paris is campus? campus. The one on the other end of this display is ours. Okay. Same, the same sort of stylized. You can't really discern much from that. I feel like that's probably on purpose because too many of us are like, ah, I can recognize this from the bottom. <laughs> yeah. I guess this will be the interest because that's probably the Starks. Uh... So you've been to the studios part, yes, in Paris. Yes. And that's where this is going. Right, in the the, uh, the sort of studio area, yeah. right? The so it's that back building is the reskinned rock, rock and roller coaster to Iron Man. Okay, rock and roller coaster. That, I believe this would have been that back on Express restaurant, yeah. which would now be him. That's that, that was Armageddon. Ar oh, okay, yeah, Armageddon and. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the explosion yeah. stunt thing, yeah. right? Okay. And then this this whole area yeah. is a disaster. So yeah. anything yes. that they do here would be an improvement. And so okay, that's that's gotta yeah, that's the walk in right there. Yeah. See so how you've been to that park, so you can now you can kind of visualize yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Be like, okay, I get it. Well, and not to mention Tower of Terror would be right there That'd also. Be, uh, about here -ish. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Alright. Concept really art. Yeah, this, so is this is ours. Yeah, this one's ours. See, there's the little string. Yeah, so you're telling me that the Sanctum Sanatorium was here? Well, a Sanctum. This is the easy because they currently switched to this suit as the main reason. He looks small. He's why do I feel? Why do I feel like he looks like a like a 14 year old in there? <laughs> Almost like Peter Parker is a young man. I know, right? <laughs> so this is the. Well, so here's the Sanctum. This is oh, it's the Sanctum or yeah. a Sanctum, yes. but not the not, not the Sanctum. Not the New York Sanctum or the Hong Kong one Got or it. the London one. A different one that hasn't been around for a while and is unveiled. Strange is unveiled. Was left him. Okay. Uh, that's a lot to read. What what is? Did you read that yet? I did. Again. In, there's a bit of a lot of sort of flavor text, but again, the short of it is that there was a sanctum here. Stark happens, his father, I believe, what's your father, who's read his father's files. Oh, uh, okay. And so pretty, I guess his dad knew that there was a site here, I guess. Okay, and it looks like this is that area where we saw yeah. the doctor. Where they'll do the whatever show. The, the show, yeah. yeah. All right. Is, uh, little interactive display. That looks like it works. Yeah. People That's are, functional. Yeah, people are making the person standing there. It's really just okay. It's a different display, but it's being controlled by the person. Yeah. So, yeah. Ian, yeah, make that guy, make that guy happen. What are we looking at? Oh, you, it's like your toe.
already started. It does feel pretty cool to do. So, is that is that the Iron Man series? Now, do you think that we can create a whole new element from this thing, like they did in Iron Man Two or Three? There's two. Two, yeah. Probably not just for this, but this does, this does feel kind of cool. I'm not gonna lie. It, yeah. The, the, it's a little odd to, to get used to, but we find this. Yeah, we find this though, and this could be something that we're doing. That's cool. Yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, another. Okay, that's the same campus, right? Same piece of art. Same thing on the other side. Now, over there, there's some big food. That was the solution to that. People were wondering why there was a giant can in the concept art. Because Ant-Man. Ant-Man. Well, yeah, we should expect to see, I guess, a giant soda can of... So I know, that's the soda brand that was in the Incredible Hulk that they were making in the factory in South America. That killed Stan Lee. So see, there's the tower. Yeah. Spidey. Mater is right over here. Mater, yeah, right there. Work suppliers, restroom. Him, quick service, strange corner, yeah. undershot, guardians. So I think guardians is, they, I feel like it needs to be a little more It does, angled. yeah, it doesn't. It's not laid out quite exactly. Yeah. So I feel like guardians is a little more angled that way. But still, right. this gives, this should give you the idea. Okay. This is Hong Kong Star Trek Expo with the Iron Man experience and Ant Man. So that's not. It's not. Someone confirmed it's not. No, okay, thank Cause, God. Because E90, ED92, the Disneyland Paris like vlog account, yeah. out, a fan account, you should put out a tweet like, oh, I guess these should yeah, be let's, Spider Man. Somebody said that that was the, the actual. And I was like, seriously, there was the same reason. There's those no just, way. Those just Astro Blasters. Yeah. And they had already deleted their tweet. And then some of those who came here during the media preview, well, I was confirmed that the rap no, these are from Hong Kong. Okay. That's the answer. Yeah, because that is a, on under underneath the skin. It's Astro Blasters. It, the Ant Man. The Ant Man right in the bottom. Right, Ant Man. It, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's, it's it's you know what? It's not even as good as Astro Blasters, if you ask that's me. That's a discussion for another day. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So that's pretty much that, yeah, right? And they brought one of the Vialus from. The oh, from Guardians. Yeah, the Guardians Tower. I mean, those are things are interesting. So they're kind of, they're, they're, they're designed program to be reactive to so people watching. Oh, really? I mean, it's hard to tell because we're always behind them in the fast pass. Yeah. Well, okay. you walk right by them. Yeah. This guy, he's looking at this guy. The real he is giving him a little. Yeah. So like. Oh, you can hear him too. Yeah. Hey, little guy. Yeah. You, you know what? I they just made eye contact. Yeah. They are. They are. They are reactive. They're, they're a cool little mini. Mic. I believe the cars are called Micro Life. Yeah. The attempt to build smaller animatronics that could be a smaller like, footprint, but also be a little more reactive. Okay. Take me next door. So, yeah, this is for Magic Kingdom. Yeah. I don't know if they'll change the name. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, Mike Cycle Run. That's a new piece of art. Uh, that's Magic Kingdom. Yeah. And the Psyche. Like the, uh, Look, there's the track right yeah. there. Wait, the uh, big. Okay. Well, it, I mean, it, it is it is that you have to walk up that to get to the right. But it does look like they're kind of walking casually, though, right? I mean, that, that's how concept that concept art always shows people casually strolling. I know. Hey, speaking of which, well, never mind. When we get there, I'll ask you about it. Uh, just for, if you haven't seen the Tron ride, this thing pops out. Yes. And then that kind of attaches to your back. Yeah, it lowers it down to secure you in. Snaps you in almost. Yeah, and you are laying down. Yeah. You feel like you're riding a light motorcycle. Yeah. All right, take me over here. I don't know. What do you think? It's very cartoonish, which it should be, because it's based off because it's the movie shows. It should be cartoonish. Well, I would like it more cartoonish. Is what I'm saying. I, I didn't think it, I didn't think they went far enough. I don't know. The tag says it's this thing. It's not a weird bit where I'm not. It's not actually yet. In, it's not in town, so. Yeah. That's the image I that I saw yesterday or on Twitter didn't really give yeah. you any of that detail. You probably can. The train. And we love trains. Now, uh, 
Don't you mean the rise of the resistance ride vehicle? I mean, I'm sure it's base A base technology. It looks very similar. Well, not this, obviously, but that. Yes. Right there. And having is, sat in the ride vehicle for rise at Celebration, yes. Ah. Because they had the, I got to sit in and take a picture. Nice. Yeah. I do love, I love. This thing is super The cute. engine. No, yeah, this thing is really cute. I, I really do love like, this. I, and look at that, look at that big old ride vehicle for what, eight people? Well, there's probably going to be a couple parts, because I remember, trackers people. Uh, Right, okay. separate. It's like, oh my God, we're all going different places. Even still, right. I, I think that, that I think they I think they went just far enough in terms of its design. Yeah. I think it's it's not it's super, a, you know, like it's, yeah. I think it's the right amount. You know, some of these things that on a maquette are flat will have dimension in, in reality. Yeah. Right. Yeah. All right. What else we got? Uh, so Epcot's getting a whole bunch of attention. Epcot. So they've got a bunch of merch for it that's premiering at Mickey's of Glendale here. And I have no idea them. they had little logos or for all the little different oh, yeah. areas. Yeah, I want to say, were those Mark Davis or Marty Scars were? Really? Yeah, they, those, if those go back to the, yeah. Yeah. The, all the people. I don't know enough about Epcot. Now, a number of the places got slightly designed and a bunch of new ones as well. Yeah. So like, see, Commuter Core is now going to be gone, so I, that's not quite yeah. anymore, but that yeah. would be the Land Pavilion. Yeah. I believe that's probably the new Moana Journey of Water. Okay, which sounds great. Living Seas. I'm not quite sure what that is. Uh, I don't know, yeah. That's Spaceship Earth for sure. Okay. Not sure. All right, that's basketball. Imagination oh. Pavilion. <laughs> That looks a lot like the old World of Motion, so I'm saying test track, okay. because it looks like... And again, these last three are all new, That's I don't new. know. That might be Guardians, the one that almost looks like a ship flying. Yeah. Well, there are a lot of lands and pavilions yeah, at so Epcot. Yeah, so they have a bunch of, like, posters that are all gorgeous. Yeah. Attractions and pavilions past and present. Because some of these things are definitely no longer here. And so... We don't even know what that. Two, yeah, there's two posters on either side that are covering say Pavilion Sunday, and we're gonna look at the big Epcot model. And there's two pavilions on there that have nothing announced, or everything else on that that model has something. Two no pavilions. Two. What is it? Where is that? Oh, here we go. Look at that. So each one of these little portions is a pavilion. A, 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 a pavilion. One of the pavilions. Yeah. It's too bad they can't actually give it the whole layered effect like they're doing here. Because that mean, looks yeah. pretty great. And again, uh, this is more of a artistic interpretive model. It's not like a one-to-one -one model. By because the way, things are not laid out this way. That's Mexico. It is. With a giant guitar. Guitar on it. If okay, I, I don't know guess. Epcot, but I know they don't have a guy, giant guitar on there. No, if I had to guess, Coco was trying to come here. That seems like a confirmation. That one thing that that's an eye hydration that the house done. I can because the existing, I love the three caballeros. I'll just say, the three caballeros are great. But the existing ride is very clunky in its, in its execution. Yeah. There are is it well attended? Well enough, and that's an indoor boat ride with AC. Well, what I mean to say is, do people go? Yes. Yeah. It's not empty, but as far as the actual ride goes, there, while there are a lot of screens, they're not integrated in a very natural way, in that you, you they, can see Donald on the They added them after the fact. Yeah, and you can see Donald the caballeros on multiple screens at the same time. Uh, it's uh, my... Now, the animatronics of the three caballeros at the end are yeah. great. And that's but, that's built into around the restaurant, right? Uh, well, the opening of the ride is similar okay. to the way the opening of Pirates is. Got it. A restaurant okay. that's like that. Got it. Uh, okay, so Moana. So this is a new movie called The Journey of Water, inspired by Moana. I wish they could just let those last two words off. Because The Journey of Water, that's a great name for an Epcot facility, right? In the yeah. name of Wonders of Life, yeah. World of Motion, you know, and, you know, the universe of energy. It's never going to happen. That's a, that's a great movie. <laughs> Never gonna happen, Ian. <laughs> we have the, the Imagination Pavilion, which has nothing really announced. So, but not Figment? I think that's the thing, I don't know. That is where Figment goes, yes. right? The, the spring should have his pride and glory, but his current existence is a sad shell. I, uh. Whatever they announce tomorrow could either make me really happy or really like, oh, that's okay, but you could do better. I thought I heard, I thought I heard that Figment was staying. The question is, is, is if he have to, does he have to make room for Inside Out, or is it a true makeover for Figment? We'll find out tomorrow. They could coexist, can't they? They could, but you know where the focus would be. Yeah, yeah. It would be, it, the reality is it would be an Inside Out attraction that happens to also have Figment. Yeah. So I, I, and I love Inside Out. It's one of my favorite I love it too, yeah. But I want Figment and Imagination really to be its own thing. I do too. This is the what is the Yeah, what is the focus here, Ian? This is the Guardian <laughs> Ticket the Galaxy attraction. In the bag of no, yeah, where's the ride 
building. Well, yeah. I, don't, I don't see the Rye you building. Yeah. The blue, so you <laughs> don't notice it, right? It's all sky blue. You'll never see it. Space Pavilion, what is what's new there is the Space Restaurant. Yeah. I don't know how much yeah. you can hear from me. I'm trying to stay behind well, the camera. Well, that's what, yeah, behind the camera's better. You're opening a space restaurant. The idea is that you'll enter a quote unquote space elevator and go up. That's amazing. I'm doing quotation marks. Yeah, yeah. We'll go up to your space restaurant with a giant window view of space. I like it. I'm down. I dig it. It's dip. Yeah. Uh, so here's the yeah, France the, Pavilion where Remy's Ratatouille Adventure is it's under construction. For years to come. Not a fan of this ride. What do you think? From video, doesn't look great to me. Like, there's parts where I watch video, like, I see the problem just because it's like, there are ways to do simulators that work yeah. well. I feel like there are certain almost just basic principles to make a simulator effective. And watching the video, they didn't like, do it. I feel like they missed some of those. They didn't do those and things. Not, <laughs> and really, so a lot of these things aren't hard moves. It's, yeah. But still, I believe this is going to be like these sort of like new festival center beer garden thing in the new spine. You're saying this is a spot for... They could. I don't know if they will, because they only have two posters that say we're going to be on Sunday, not three. There's, yeah, that one. The gap there apparently is a poster that sells. It's not a spot to go But why does it be feeling Sunday then? No, that one is. I'm talking about down here. Oh, over there. That's okay. That yeah, See? I was going to say, that one is definitely going to be feeling so Sunday. at least two reveals. Yeah, that could be either a pavilion or... One of those two things I mentioned that don't have anything announced yet, but right. this model. Yeah. So Miner said, I would assume anything on here has something coming. It is. That's Right there, Ian. Okay, then that's... I guess that's that. That's wild, isn't it? I'm, yeah, I don't know how tall that'll actually be, but I'm assuming that's the beer garden. That seems very beer garden-y. Yeah? yeah? Okay. Yeah, because it's that's where the old character meat building was, I think. Well, right? yeah, so... Epcot, has, there's an area called Commuter Corner. There were two interventions buildings. They're okay. demoing only one of them, which feels right. Like, I feel a like, left, there's a left and a right. Like, I feel like if I forget one, you should get rid of both, so it actually feels fresh. Symmetry. But I also get demoing and rebuilding is expensive. Yeah. And like, it's a big building, you can do stuff. Yeah. Like, I feel like if they're gonna get rid of one, they should get rid of both. Yeah. Hey, so if it's gonna be well, a fresh start for the park, you need you. If you're gonna get rid of one, get rid of both, so it's truly fresh. Otherwise, we're still gonna be hanging on. Like, oh, I remember when this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was Oh, look at this. They got some... I didn't see this yesterday. It's over. Uh, but, but some of the work, artwork for the Journey of Water. Yeah, I saw just the one piece of concept art. Yeah. We might find out more about that tomorrow. Here's yeah. Galaxy. Yeah. Tomorrow's huge focus is going to be at Yeah. And, and then hopefully Tomorrowland. On here. Crossing my fingers on Tomorrowland. And then, but there was one last thing here. Oh, yeah. We do Go know ahead. that the Chinese Million is getting a new Circle Vision 360 show. Oh, great. And I believe it's supposed to be seamless screens because right now you can kind of, you can see gaps where you can see where sure. the screens line up. Sure. So it's got you know you know upgrades to be seamless all around. Okay. Oh, that's right. We've got all the way around that, right? Yeah. Okay. All again, all the stuff in the top center is all kind of that core garden here. Yeah. That oh that's the yeah that's the that's what I was talking about yeah. right there. That's the floating yeah. uh, restaurant looking thing. Yeah. Uh, what is this? Let's so continue around the side. That's the plate. Sure does look like that. I'm sure we'll find out some more tomorrow. Space restaurant. Oh, this is the. Uh, this yeah, the they've been talking about this for almost like a year and a half now. It feels well, like. They announced it at the last D23. Yeah, they did, right? And it's it's pretty hard to work. It's supposed to open this fall. This feels a lot like uh, the Star Wars hotel yeah, kind of. I was gonna say this will be our first glimpse at the idea of making a window seem like space. How convincingly can they make a? Yeah. Screen, see Mike's face. Speaking of which, let's go look at that. Where's that at? That's almost, that'll probably be the last thing we touch. Oh, okay. A couple more things along the way. Oh, we got more over here? Color is what's new. Okay, we're this at, is Tokyo. this is Tokyo. They have a Fantasyland special, a little bit of tomorrow. And oh, and the new castle too, right? No, that's Hong Kong. But, but they are building a proper just towards the scale of this castle okay. rather than the first perspective thing they have. Okay. The oh, good. So they replace their sort of natural order. What's going to be the main axis of the Kirby 600? Where's that at? Right there now. So let's make that sound like right that. Oh, oh, okay. I, oh, it's underneath it. Yes. It's more like the one at Toy Story. Yes, that's coming. Kind of cool. Yeah. All the stuff in the back that's going on. What is that? A very beautiful dish that I'm not going to die. I was going to say, that looks like an old 
Shakespearean Theater well, from London. Oh, that's just an entry, so yes. they're not going to do it. Oh, that's too bad. I would have liked to see the show right there in the round. Well, we see the castle right there. Yeah. Right there. All right, beautiful. Oh, that's that new beautiful animal. Scott Trowbridge is in your frame. You're sharing frame with Scott Trowbridge. I just want you to know that. It's fine. We're good. I'm, I'm going to pretend like I'm, I'm talking gonna, to I'm you. I'm going to try to know the dismount right now. <laughs> <laughs> and the backside of Scott Trowbridge. <laughs> I am becoming a fan. I'm becoming yes. a fan of his. I was saying it's a very cool ship. Very cool. It's meant to be, you know, in the now, special of the Corellian Corvettes, so like the Tanta B4. Yeah. Although I say it should be pronounced Tantive. Lucasfilm and Sis should be called Tanta B. Oh I disagree. I Feminently. <laughs> Ian, <laughs> you just let all your nerd out just now. You let it all out just now. When do I ever hold it? I don't know. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I had to guess. This is, this is a Corellian shipmaker that makes this. A Corellian, okay. Yeah. Well, it does look very Star yeah. Wars, I'll say but, that. But a passenger cruise ship. Uh, now, the reason why I thought, I did a video and I said, I can't believe they're going to put that on the ground. I the way that they are... Because it's, it's a small building. It's right. only about two stories. No, that's true. Uh, it just, some of the, the bones of the bones of what we can see look like they could fit in that. You know, like the, okay. the way, the, the front of it and the, and the, and the, and the hall. But the back, I don't know. That's a whole yeah. other story. That's what my... You fit what the you fit the ship within yeah. what appears to be a space station, and you and you have some sort of transport experience, whether yeah. that's something like a stretching room type experience or something like what we're going to experience on Rise of Resistance, yeah. where you it seems to you that you are taking off from your space station up to the Halcyon. The uh, the cut the the concept art or no, it wasn't the concept art. It was the uh, the floor plan mm -hmm. that I that, that was released. That's yeah, it. that's not a lot of rooms, by no. the way. This is a small capacity, small. 
this high cost sort of experience. Good luck ever getting a room in this place. Uh, but it did look like there was a possibly optional, you could sort of take the super fun way yeah. of getting into the ship or if, or really tired, you just need to get if you just want to get in it looked like there was a so yeah I would say like if you're paying that much I would hope that you're going in with please the, do the, the super fun way yeah attitude to do that. <laughs> like you're spending that money to have a yeah. immersive Star Wars and cruise like experience yeah do the super fun way there's definitely more art on the screens than it has been like yeah I haven't seen that picture before also seems like when they so you look up the, the, yeah, yeah. Tells you this is it's, where uh, this thing is. There's like mapping going on yeah, here. Yeah, so like, when it'll be, it'll be like this one. Yeah, it's being scanned, just like that, yeah. This I've seen. See the projection, now that's projection. Oh, that's this? Yes. Oh, well let's follow along then. dollars that you would like to spend on a hotel <laughs> my dude it's hard for me to I couldn't justify spending a hundred bucks on gold member just to try to get into I know right <laughs> I, it's I'm cheap. I know I'm it's cheap. so am I this is expensive yeah okay I, I okay do. what's that see it is it's the bar it's like Ooh, that's new that's new I have not seen this art before playing, either playing they're playing sabak you're right they are Digital Sabak. <laughs> Which is kind of what it was in an old extended expanded universe. It was more like the cards could could digitally change. Yeah. To make them not change, you put them in like a field, but that means you couldn't change you couldn't change them by locking them in. Alright. It uh, looks so like it's an actual rule set. I think they stopped scanning. I would say I do wonder what is how the because you're gonna be staying in a room that instead of a window has a view into space. Yeah. How do you have a sense of time on awake when it comes to waking up and going to bed when all windows show space and not the outside world? Uh, how, how do they, as creatively, how do you combat people's need oh. to have a sense of what time it is? They're docking. What, yeah. what way do you, how do you use those window screens? So well, screen unless, because there's no light, be, right. You can't even, there's no daylight. Coming. You can't put, you can't even put artificial light there. I mean, you, you can, but you have to be careful how you do it. So, like that. Well, that's going to be an interesting challenge that I, I... In the future... I probably won't see it in person, but to hear how did they solve that, you know? Uh, okay, oh, by the way, that's the, uh... Main deck atrium. Main deck atrium. So that would probably be the position where, like, you actually find that board mission. Yeah. It's like a common area. Yeah, so the actually checked in the station. Uh, in the future movies, people, instead of having windows, because they live in giant block buildings where everybody, you know, because they're running out of space. In future movies, you don't have a window, you have a screen. But they, they that, can always somehow perfectly simulate daylight. Right, the, well they project a fake daylight. Yeah. You can say, you can order yeah. morning please, and then you get birds and trees yeah. and stuff. I wonder if that's a thing that you could do. Yeah. But yeah, like I said, I'll be fascinated to see how, because yeah. that's a real thing. If people are sleeping somewhere, part of what wakes you up is daylight. Yep. Is a, a, a set yep. time frame of, oh, it's daytime, now it's nighttime. How do you simulate that when a ship is you in space? You can sleep for days at a place like that. <laughs> like, you're granted you're only there for two nights, so your body yeah. shouldn't get thrown off for too long. Right, well, they but, have longer stays, though, don't they? I, we don't know yet. I guarantee nothing like that's super locked down this far out. So we're still at least a year away. If, if you could afford a 3000 you could afford a 6000 Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> but right. now, th okay, that actually... Uh, begs another question that I have about this while we're on the topic. Mm -hmm. Each day, somebody, somebody's get, is the experience that they're going to, just your, your guess, is the experience that they're going to create for us, strictly speaking, a three day, two night experience that, let's say if you were to get six days, would it reboot? Well, I see that, I, I have no way to know that kind of lot. Because here's the thing, it depends if they're framing it as people only check in on certain days and they see right. the frame, or if anyone can, if people can check in on the between. And that's yeah. there's no way for us to know. That was my other question, yeah. yeah. How do you, how do, what if there's, what if there's over, what if there's overflow you know, maybe or maybe tomorrow after overlap. the parks panel, I come over, see Sarah Sterling, <laughs> who uh, is, works in Imagineering cool. on this project, and yeah. ask her, hey. In, 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 from what you know and could say, yeah. how, how might that work? How might because that work? Here, we know people at Imagineering and be like, you do cool stuff. I'd be willing to guess 
that they want to keep things as oh, symmetrical sure. as possible, that to your, what you suggested is everybody's all on the same calendar. Yeah, I'm sure it'd be similar from an operations perspective yeah. as well. Well, and, but also for show. Yeah. Uh, for for Because you don't want people saying, hey, what day are you on? You run into somebody in the lobby. Yeah. Like, where are you in your experience? Plus, just plus, when you're on a cruise, everyone boards the cruise and exits the same day. That's right. Yeah. So, yeah. And you have your port day where you all go out, all your veteran comes then come back to yep. the ship. Right? Yep. It sounds cool. I'll, I don't know if I'll ever get to experience it myself. Not in my lifetime, probably. probably not, not in my lifetime. But Unless Disney that, buys. If they're that, paying, then I'm going. See that exists for rich people. <laughs> yep. Which does not include you and me. No. All right. Well, I guess that's it. We're going to close off the date now. Uh, we're coming back tomorrow. Yeah. We might doing... swing back here for more show. I mean, if not, I'll definitely Maybe. swing back by. Yeah. Uh, and I, well, I, there's a few other things on the floor that I want to see, but we'll check those yeah. out tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be busy. Exactly, because there's a whole host of things I want to do. I got to right? make them happen. I know, right? There's too much to do. Yeah. Uh, but we got parks panel and then the floor, I guess. Yeah. So thanks for watching Fresh Bake, and we'll see you then. Bye. Fresh Bake, bye. Down, Downer Central. Boba Fett hanging out with some princesses. I told them, I was like, I was really worried when I got in my door. The bride. Another bride. Red the pirate. <laughs> Fantastic. I saw it. Yeah, there's Jack Sparrow up there. Another Jack Sparrow. Oh my god, he looked just like him. That's great. Wow. Huh? I found myself unable to leave this place because they just keep taking great, amazing pictures. All these people bounding. They're all so fantastic. I can't leave. Oh my god. <laughs> this Jack knows how to do uh, the facial expression. And by the way, this Boba Fett right here, he doesn't have his helmet on right now, but he's got a voice modulator. So he'll talk to you through his helmet with, a, with the voice modulator. And I guess that's... I just can't even. It's so, so great. And alas, I do have to leave. I know we tried to sign off earlier, but when I came out of here, I couldn't, I couldn't believe how cool it was walking out of this place. Those two were the Mickey hands. We saw them earlier. They've taken off their hands. Uh, what a what a fun day. What a fun day. I'm exhausted. I feel like I got nothing done, but it was still a fun day, and I get to do it again tomorrow. We'll see you then, Fresh Baked. We've got lots more videos for you to see, so grab a churro and check out some of our other videos and have your mind blown by how much fun we're having. We truly are the best of Disney Bake Fresh daily. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We'll see you next time. Fresh Baked!